Hello everyone, I hope you all are doing well. Today we will learn chapter 7 from shelters to village settlements. In the previous chapter, we have learned the process of making tools in a stone age, right? In this chapter, we will learn what was the process of village settlement from shelter or how did the process of village settlement took place from shelter. Under this, we will cover up shelter, seasonal camps and village settlement. So let's begin the lecture and if you are new to my channel, please subscribe, like and press the bell icon for notification. So let's start with shelter. What is the meaning of shelter? Shelter means a place that gives temporary protection from bad weather or danger. It means a place that gives temporary protection from bad weather or danger. So here we will learn where human beings took shelter in stone age. Children, in the beginning of middle stone age, the climate in the Europe was extremely cold. So to protect themselves, Nindarthal wore leather clothes and made use of fire. But the temperature was so cold that perhaps it was not enough and therefore they erect tent inside the cave so that they can keep themselves warm. You can see a tent erected by Nindarthal in your book. You can see this picture. It was erected by Nindarthal man inside a cave. So on this basis, we can say that to protect themselves from the freezing temperature, Nindarthal took shelter in cave and learned to erect tents. I hope this is clear to you. Now let's move on to next point which is seasonal camp. Seasonal camps. As we know that people took shelter in cave to protect themselves from extreme cold weather. They also learned to erect tent inside the cave, right? But during the Middle Stone Age, the climate in Europe was getting warmer. Everywhere the environment was changing. And due to environmental change, big animals like mammoth were on the way to extinct. Okay, they were on the way to extinct. Means they were about to finish. You can see the picture of mammoth. Uh, nowadays they are extinct means they are not available. But they are considered to be ancestor of elephant. So what happened that uh, homo sapiens uh, hunted a small animals like wild boar, deer, mountain goat and sheep. And they also turned to fishing. Since the diet of Homo sapiens changed, this enabled them to roam to far away regions and they cleared jungles and set up camps. They moved to different places as per the seasonal changes. Means according to requirement, they moved to different places. They harvested wild grains, gathered seasonal fruits and roots undertook fishing, hunting and thereby they stayed longer period at a place. In this way, they established camp all over the world. You can see a camp, a seasonal camp established by, uh, you know, Homo sapiens in Middle Stone Age. Village Settlements how did village settlements emerge in the new stone age? Let's see. Till now we have learned that in the, mid, in the old stone age, man lived in the forest and wandered from place to place in search of food. And in the middle stone age, man lived in caves and tents erected in the open. And tents erected in the open and hunted a small animal, right? But in new stone age, the way of 
of life of women was completely different during this period women became producers of food grains they learned to produce different types of food grains agriculture agriculture means farming made it possible to store food and use it over a longer period hence there was no need to keep moving constantly so the nature of agriculture work made it necessary to stay in one place and therefore people have established permanent village settlements so we can say that because of the farming because of the agriculture people established permanent village settlements and lived in them generation after generation so this is how village settlements emerge in new stone age you can see the picture of village settlement in new stone age in your book so here i am ending this lesson and in the next lesson we shall review the social organization and the culture of these village settlements so thank you uh, for listening and watching and if you like my video please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon for notification